Okay, so today I'm playing a demo of the game The Death Tree. I have no idea what to expect at all. It seems like an indie game that was uh, put up on Steam. It said it was made with Unity. Let's see. Unknown Place, 25 May 1987. The destiny of a half-human sorcerer has taken him beyond an abstract reality. First manuscript die, killing a, in quotations, family, has never been an easy duty in this disconcerting and haunted universe where anything can happen. I have to banish this, in quotations, thing, a protective being who has, no, who was human, but loving her was never a good idea. I don't know what, in quotations, it, never mind, it's gone. Uh, find and kill it. Ah, it's a goddamn zombie. Find and kill it. Okay. Come this way, zombie. I'm gonna try and... I'm gonna try and lure it over there. She knows it. Never mind. Maybe I'm supposed to go this way. That's another zombie. So much rain. Do I have a weapon? Sure doesn't feel like I have a weapon. This is so many trees. This is so many trees. That's all I have to say about that. There's a lot of trees. It's like it's like if the de the forest was extremely dense and then someone cut away only enough to make a barrier around their, their front yard, or their front pathway to their house. Hey! I'm inside now. Do I... It's still raining on my face. Oh, hi, zombie. Go away, zombie. I'm looking for anything to fight you with. Aha! Um, do I not have a visual for my gun? Oh. I don't know how to pull out my gun. That's a flashlight. That's a big tree. It's a lampshade in the middle of nowhere. I'm dead. <laughs> I tricked you, zombie! I saw it, whatever it was, something red, and it went this way. Okay, so zombie there. I really wish I knew how to pull out the gun once I pick it up over here. Reload is R. I'm hitting R. That does not seem to prompt it to come out of my inventory either. Okay, I'm just gonna hit a bunch of stuff on the keyboard. None of those did it. One! It was one! One did it. Oh! I gotcha. He, he doesn't mean anybody no harm. We can leave him be. Giant trees! Oh, mystical lampshade. Oh, okay. 
There's no, no. This is a very odd structure. Okay, cuted ram. Cute to put away. No, it's put down. Ugh. Will this do damage is the question. Can I save? A little bit of ammo if I throw this at the next zombie that tries to kill me. Oh, but I have the gun now, so maybe I can go back to that house. What's over here? Another one. Oh wait, when I was clicking around, yeah, I found the flashlight button. Okay, I don't think this is actually supposed to be something I go to, or maybe it is. Okay. Spooky cave. Oh my god. They jump scared me. Uh, Q to examine. Buddha! Like one of those cheapo ones you would find at a... At like one of those Chinese novelty shops and a random toilet. Of course, this is where the, all the, the zombies come to take dumps, you know? And they don't want the other zombies looking at them and they, and they can't build anything better. So they just got a couple of barrels there. Makes total sense. Valley of the Fallen Bear. I don't know if I should go to the Valley of the Fallen Bear yet. I want to see if I can get into that house. I've only got three ammo left, I just realized. That's real bad. That's like, I'm gonna die bad. But I want to see if I can remove those, uh, those boards to get in the front door. I'm expecting not. I wonder if there's a punch option that I just did not find out about. Hey there. You got any ammo? You know, this makes me wonder about the Unity engine, to be honest. Like, is there, is this part of the developer kit of, like, Unity, where you get, like, a, like, a standard, standard person to put in your games? The door is jammed. Okay, I don't want to go in there yet. I want to see something. So one pulls out gun, puts it away. And that is it, really. I don't... There was no option for fists that I saw. Are you serious? Find a weapon. Oh, oh so I was supposed to get in here... So I was supposed to get in here first. And just told me about an axe. Picked up a cola drink. Picked up an apple. Picked up a backpack. This TV's magic, it's not plugged in. Maybe it's Bluetooth, I don't know. No, it's a VHS monitor. No way it's a Bluetooth. Um, okay, so two cameras. Let's go see if those cameras are actually there. There's one. And there's another. They are actually there. 
So when I got in here and the jump scare tried to, to spook me, it made mention of an axe. It was a very brief description. It just said, like, axe attack. Is axe in here? Ooh, that is a slow drawer. Okay. There we go. I wonder if I have a crouch. Maybe shift is crouch. Shift is not crouch. Is this ammo? It is. Okay, now I have plenty of ammo. What about... Number three. Number three is where the axe is. Okay. So, number... So, two now equips the axe. One for gun. Two for axe. So we don't waste ammo. Oh, wait. Let's go back to this. R is reload, I remember. Putting the zombie right here... And it being able to kill you so easy. I don't I was not I was not super fond of that. How do I access my inventory? Is it I? It's not I. What's number three then? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nope. It's none of those. How do I use a med kit? How do I eat my apple? How do I drink my soda? Uh let's find out. Oh, what the fuck? What did I just hit? Okay, we have found out how to crouch. Oh, what the fuck? Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, I can do a little jig. I, can, I know how to lean right, but I don't know how to lean left. Lean left is X. Crouch is... is C? Oh. Oh, that's not very intuitive. X is right, Y is left. That is quite a reach for Y. But I wonder how necessary these are anyways. Okay, I hit like everything there. Oh, control is also... Control is also to crouch. Alright, I'm a little scared to do it, but I'm gonna hit escape to see if, uh, if that brings up the interview, uh, inventory. It does not. It's just settings. Okay, but... At least there's a more intuitive button to hit. Yeah, okay. Maybe the game will be nice and will auto apply the apple. All right, let's let's see. How good is the axe? Oh god. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, it's useless. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking <laughs> And oh my god, that's awful. That's awful. The main menu button pops up when you when you do that. So I was spam clicking trying to kill the bear. And it instantly It instantly put me back in the main menu. Oh, look at that tip tab for inventory. Now we know. Okay, yeah, I tried everything except for tab. I hit spacebar while that thing was going. Let's see. Let's try this now. Oh, fuck. Come on. Oh, fucking A, man. Come on. Holy hell, man. Come on. Okay, that's good. Now we know. The zombie is slow enough. Oh my god, man. I'm not using this axe. That is so short range. That is... That is... 
last ditch effort kind of thing. And it didn't even have good enough range to hit the bear. I should have had the gun out. I shouldn't have. I pulled this thing out to test run it and it instantly got me killed. Okay, now we gotta go get the, uh... Let's see, tab. If I eat the apple, how much is it actually gonna heal me? An apple is a sweet, edible fruit which can heal 10 HP when you eat it. Okay. I'm having to right-click twice on these to get to being able to use them. Okay. Carbonated soft drink, which can heal 10 HP when you drink it. First aid kit is an equipment that is used to give medical treatment. It fully heals your wounds. Okay. All right. Well, I'm thinking now we avoid the bear. Oh, yes, the jump scare thing. We're gonna kill this guy. Ugh, you piece of shit. Jake, oh my god. It puts away the axe if I get too close. So we're definitely not gonna go see the bear. Instead, we're gonna go into the bear valley, fallen bear valley or whatever uh, it's called. Which I wonder if it's named that because it's presumed that I've already killed the bear. But I didn't. Okay. How about this? Q. Let's see if this damages this guy. Take that! Did not. Did nothing. Okay. Whoa! Where'd you come from, buddy? Oh, come on. Ugh! Oh, holy hell, man. Oh my fucking god, this axe. Oh my god, alright. Yes, yes, very spooky. Give me the goddamn axe so I can clumsily kill this zombie. Gotcha. Okay, now we're gonna keep this stuff. And maybe we were supposed to use the med kit from the start. So that's what we're gonna try and do. Okay. <sighs> 120. Okay, so our... Full health is 120, we now know. Oh, look at that. That one's probably solar powered. All right, so now we... She knows it. The thing that she knows is it. Gotcha. Okay, that one does not mind me, so we're gonna leave him alone. Oh, I just noticed there's like a... a very Elder Scrolls Skyrim style compass up there. I'm looking at the very top of the screen at, at the locations of interest around us. So there's no locations of interest that way. There's just the bear. Okay, we're just gonna go out the door now. Does this guy spawn as soon as you pick up the, the gun? I feel like he does. I, come on, man. 
It was, um, because I picked up the axe first this time, it switched, and the gun was two. That's why I... That's why that happened. Is there anything over here? I don't think there was. I think there was just this lampshade. Okay. We're gonna do it. We're gonna... What happens if I shoot? How about this? We'll, we'll pull out the axe and we're gonna... We're gonna chop at the jump scare. Yeah! Did nothing. Which it shouldn't. It's you know... There's no way that thing is set to take damage. Valley of the Fallen Bear. All right. The game says this misty path. Oh, look it. It's a bear. Oh, oh my god. It's just a bunch of bears. Okay. All right, game. R to reload. I'm a gamer! That's right. That's right. I cheated. What is this? Game? Well, I picked this up, game. There we go. 12 gauge shells, as in. Maybe I should have a shotgun already? Or maybe... Maybe if I had gone right and killed that bear, maybe there's a shotgun to find over there. This is quickly turning into... Not a zombie game, and a bear game instead. <laughs> okay. All right. I have killed the bear. Is this Valley of Fallen Giant Scorpions or something? Nope, sounds like wolves. The fuck is a triplex? Besides being like a... Like a home for three people. For three families. Kill the triplex first. Okay. Triplex. Triplex, where are you? Triplex? Oh. Is that it? Oh my fucking god. I gotta kill these with the axe. Oh my god. I did it. I got stuck on a tree right at the end and I did it. By triplex, did it mean trio? Like trio of things I have to kill? Can I go now? It did. It did mean trio instead of triplex. But you can't go this way anyways. Holy fuck! <laughs> I'm putting my finger into the mirror in the Matrix. Oh, no. oh my god. Does that happen on everything? No, it doesn't. Just on this. What about here? No? no. Oh my god, I'll stop. Alright. 
Okay, let's go. Let's see what's in here. Is this going to be the shotgun I need? Uh, yeah, watch that probably just spawned like an enemy on me or something. I couldn't hear it very well when moving on. Gotcha. Okay. That's the wolf I already killed. Let's let's take a closer look. Whoa. Red eyes. We got clean chompers. Whatever's in this church doesn't scare me. I killed the triplex. Nothing like holding back and pointing at things' heads. Right? Does that guy just spawn with a regular wolf every time? Because he doesn't spawn with a demon wolf. Objective updated. <laughs> Triplex? Oh my fucking god. Another one of these dudes. Come on. Does the game actually pause if I do this? It doesn't look like it actually pauses. My guy was still moving. We're gonna head to the right of here after I get the gun. I wanna see what's over there. But after that, I don't think I'm gonna go fight that dude again. Yeah. Did not aggro that guy, okay. I just want to get revenge on this bear over here. Yeah. 
my god. My, my aim was not stupendous there. Oh. Oh. Okay. We got revenge on the bear that killed us first. Objective pre-completed. I don't even know how to check objectives. My God. There we go. What's this? So you can get health from them. Did you find apples on zombie bodies and you're like, yes, this is sanitary, I will eat this. Okay, so the hidden location to the right of here was a toilet. Can I even open the door to the toilet? <laughs> Let me in. Let me in. The zombies are trying to kill me, and I just need to take a shit. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Look at those <laughs> protruding slash marks. But okay. I definitely think I'm going to call it there. I don't want to fight that guy that's in that house again. So let's see. Death Tree. The Death Tree is this game. All right, if you stuck around this long, thanks for watching. I'm going to play more games like this in the future. I don't know why. I find this kind of stuff fascinating to see the creative process, especially in, in indie stuff like this, where like maybe you never know. Maybe this was part of like some student project or they were just trying on their own and that kind of thing to make something, you know, obviously by a single person and that kind of thing, you know? I find this stuff fascinating to see how, uh, how individuals' minds were working when they were doing this stuff on their own, how they, how they tried to assemble it and all that. Um, but all right. See you next time. Goodbye.